hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. And, um... Alright, so where to start with? Uh, one thing about the Robot Masters, or at least their weapons, is that most of them have separate utility purposes. So with that in mind, that's going to drive where I want to go first. At least where I think I want to go first. Um, and so we'll start out with Yamato Man. And I like this remixed version, and we have grasshoppers now. There's, well, if my memory of the stage is correct or it hasn't changed from uh, previous version, this can be tricky. If you jump uh, at the peak of that, you'll hit that shield guy and you'll knock yourself into the pit. Kind of a nasty little trick, and I love the design of that. So we have some fairly typical Yamato Man stuff. I noticed I couldn't shoot the... Uh, his little bouncy orbs. I think you can do that in Mega Man 6. I could be wrong on that as well. Now that one up up there, it's actually very easy to get. All you need is a hop there. And then don't bother going sliding that way and going back. Just, just go back over here and jump on the spikes. If you actually jump, you can land on the grasshopper and continue on. All right, let's try this again, but more successful this time. Hooray! And we also have those little uh, conveyor platforms that don't look like they move that fast, and in reality they don't. Some quick uh, jumping can actually get you around that guy on the previous screen, as you saw there. Alright, let's not screw up easy jumps, and let's continue on. Uh, I like holding the charge shot up, because uh, mean things can be taking place. Uh, the charge shot feels a bit more powerful than usual here, uh, taking out those shielded guys in one shot. But, uh... Yeah, more familiar enemies. I approve of seeing all of these guys. And, well, we missed the point. And I don't believe there's anything to the right. I wonder if there's still those super secret Easter egg areas in this. Ooh, do be mindful of which, which way the conveyors are taking you. And here's something where we need a really small jump. And just because there's water down there doesn't mean you should be going down. Uh, there's no hidden paths there. And there's another brick that we can't break. And another mini E-tank. And here's something where we need the fire weapon. Whoa. That's silly. I, I don't remember that happening. Uh, we'll get the points and we'll just move on. So that gives us some other sort of power-up that we can't reach yet. Clearly we need a fire weapon. This game does do a good job of requiring uh, a variety of different weapons in order to collect everything, as opposed to just needing like one or two of the weapons. And we have a a uh, nice mini-boss fight, basically the same thing as the uh, Mega Man 6 version. And once again, we need another special weapon for that. There are typically three hidden things per stage, so uh, yeah, there'll be a lot of things to do. Well, we made it halfway. I don't remember a uh, second one of those frog guys being there. It just kind of threw me off. Did I just get hit by him as he was exploding? 
Well, I didn't take damage for that, so I guess that's okay. And as I recall, there are a lot of uh, very tight jumps. Oh, of course I died right before the boss. Yeah, I think this section was a, uh, or at least the section before the boss gate in the original was a uh, disappearing block puzzle, and kind of a nasty one that is designed so you can't really use Rush Jet to get through it, even though I still managed to find a way to do that anyways. Now I'm just going to be quiet and let you guys enjoy this music for a little while. Okay, so as you can tell, uh, Yamato Man has gained some new tricks from Mega Man 6, and he's become a lot faster, too. Notice how he's able to jump most of my shots, and that attack spread always gets me. Another thing I, I like is that the spears will stay... ow. Kind of in the ground uh, for a brief moment, but you're not damaged by them once they're in the ground. Oh, you're supposed to be done. And it's this this spear barrage always tends to get me. Oh, I jumped too soon there. I thought he was gonna throw some more spears. I was gonna say, please don't let that be a game over. That would be unfortunate. We have, uh, this is our last life. Alright, so we gotta beat Yamato Man this time. We can do it. Uh, but this boss battle music, uh, the remix version of the Mega Man 3 boss fight, it is my favorite music in the entire game. And... I'm just trying to country on this. And, uh... I can get this music stuck in my head uh, from playing this game, and that's certainly not a bad thing. I think uh, his spear barrages go longer when you have him lower on health. Might be easier to stand in front like that. Also, I love how when he's rotating his spear like that, he's uh, immune to frontal attacks from the buster. That's a very nice touch. It's a very nice touch that might get me killed. If you stand about halfway, you can make it through his attacks. Oh, it slid instead of shot. Well, that's not good. I want his power. And it does start us back at the beginning. Alright, time to die to Yamato Man some more. I mean, let's see if we can beat him. I was wondering if he was just going to stand there the whole time. I like standing towards the back, because when he comes charging, it's easier to dodge. Hi. Sometimes uh, he gets into a frenzy where he won't move until uh, 
Like right now, he's not gonna move till I make a move. And now he's gonna move. Oh. That's the first time I've seen him do the, uh, oh. Gotcha. Ooh. So as you can tell, the uh, Robot Masters have also been upgraded in this game, which is another wonderful touch. I love the added uh, new moves that they get in addition to their old moves, new abilities, new patterns. Uh, it's, it's everything I'd expect from a uh, Mega Man fan game that brings back old Robot Masters. And that will be all for this stage, and as you can see now that we uh, beat that, we can tell that that uh, weird-looking item that we didn't pick up was the Super Slide. So we'll have to go back there and get that later.